There are several different ways to send a text broadcast. First, let's log into the Merchant Portal. The first way you can send a text broadcast is by navigating to the Loyalty tab here on the dashboard. You will see a variety of reports from member ratings, days between visits, and customer lifetime value. In each one of these charts, you can select who you want to send your text broadcast to. For example, say we want to send a text broadcast to the customers that haven't been in for a while. I can select multiple segments of this graph by clicking Control, which allows me to only send a text to those specific people. Once you are done selecting the customers you wish to target, click Text Broadcast. It's now time to decide your send method. There are three different options, short code, bulk plus short code, and bulk only. Short code is your traditional delivery method. The customers will receive the text message immediately. Sending your text message via bulk messaging is a little bit different. Bulk messaging delivers text messages through the phone carrier's email database. This avenue of delivery cuts your costs in half but does not guarantee a specific time that it will be delivered to your customer. Delivery times can vary from 5 minutes to a few hours. So if your text broadcast needs to be delivered immediately, we suggest using only the short code delivery system. If time isn't a huge consideration, we suggest saving some money and using the bulk plus short code delivery method. Once you've chosen your delivery method, click Next. This screen is where you type your text broadcast message. You may type up to 160 characters for the text broadcast. If you wish to generate a unique coupon code, select Automatically Generate Coupon. This is a good option if you want to specify a date range for your offer. The code will be redeemed in the system at the time of purchase. Once you have your message completed, click Next. From here you can send a proof to yourself, send it now, or schedule it for later. When you are done, click Finish. A confirmation box will appear to ensure that you are ready to send your text broadcast. We recommend using this method to send your text broadcast. There are two other ways to send your text broadcast. You may navigate to Broadcast and click Text. You will notice the same screen as we just saw in the previous example, where you can choose which list or saved report you want to use, you can select the send method, and you can continue with the text broadcast process that we just saw. The last way to send a text broadcast is by navigating to Reports on the menu, then clicking Loyalty. Here you can directly select a list or create a new list and then click Text Blast. Once you click on Text Blast, it will take you through the previous steps we showed you. Again, we recommend you send the text broadcast by navigating to the Loyalty tab on the home page and by using our easy-to-use segmented reporting features. You have now just successfully sent a text broadcast.